Son of a Sometimes I accidentally buy a variety pack of coffee, and I accidentally drink either cinnamon roll, decaf, or hazelnut. I want flavored and decaf coffee as far away from me as possible. I've tried several methods to get the coffee as far away from me as possible to no avail. So the only thing that I could come up with is a K-cup cannon. Much like a potato cannon, but for K-cups. <laughs> I'm gonna make a K-cup catapult. But I'm not just gonna build any catapult, I'm going to build a trebuchet. Because we all know that a trebuchet is the superior seed. But I'm not gonna build just any trebuchet, I'm gonna build the Da Vinci trebuchet. Because that dude has some dope designs. <laughs> The K-Cup catapult consists of five main parts. There's the frame, the pivot point, the beam, the counterweight, and the sling. The base of the catapult is going to be about two feet by four feet, and the beam is going to be about four and three quarters long. I'm going to hold everything together with these decking screws because Da Vinci would have totally used decking screws. Now onto the beam. So the beam at the pivot point is going to be one foot on one side and 3.75 feet on the other. The beam is glued and screwed. Now gotta build the counterweight bucket. Beam and bucket combination is swinging pretty good. Now I'm going to mount it to the mast. Okay, I've got it doing catapult things. Now I'm just gonna make the sling and test it out with a couple objects. I think I had the K-Cup catapult dialed in as much as I can with this size and the weights that I have. Now I just want to put some fancy Da Vinci design on this thing and make the ratchet portion.
and a rock for good measure. This cinnamon roll coffee could be a little bit further away from me, but that's all the catapult could do. 